We're gonna close up this lesson by making sure that you have a grasp on those natural logarithms. So the natural logarithm, you need to be able to simplify this expression without using your calculator. And fairly quickly, just like when you're multiplying numbers or if I ask you what's three plus seven and you can say 10 right away, you should be able to say the natural log of E is equal to and know what it's equal to like super quick. If you don't know, it won't take long for you to have that memorized. Natural log is the same thing as log base E. Log base E of E is one. E to the first power is E. So natural log of E is one. Memorize it, make yourself a flashcard. On the front side, put natural log of E, and on the back side, put one. Natural log of E to the negative two, you might remember this from our table that we created. Natural log of E to the negative two. See if you can come up with the answer. Press pause if you're thinking about it. Welcome back if you're done thinking and you wanna check your answer and you think it's negative two, you're absolutely correct. And now natural log of one, natural log of one. Again, press pause if you're thinking about it. If you're not thinking about it, maybe envision natural log is the same thing as log base E. E to what power is one? Well, e to the zero power is one. Therefore, the natural log of one is equal to zero. Now, you'll get lots of practice with this in the homework, and it is so important for you to get that practice so that you feel really good about what we've done here, and you can use these tools moving forward 